I'm Annie Stores. Welcome back to another video. So I'm loving seeing all of the fake away videos and I'm especially pleased to see um, restaurants and fast food chains releasing their own version of recipes. So today we are going to make the IKEA meatballs with the cream sauce. We're going to have it with chips because if you have seen our previous video around the IKEA food challenge then you'll see that we always have it with chips rather than mash. So um, let's crack on and I'll show you how we do it. So I'll start with the ingredients for the meatballs. We have 500 grams of minced beef. We've got 500 grams of pork mince, although we only need to use 250 grams. We have 100 grams of breadcrumbs. We didn't have any breadcrumbs, so I've just blitzed up some um, bread that we had. It's one onion and a garlic clove, one egg, some milk and salt and pepper. So that is the meatball mixture made. What I'm going to do now is just shape them into balls where they need to go in the fridge to rest for two hours before cooking. The meatball mix is made. It actually made 46 and not small ones. So um, I think the quantities are a bit wrong because I think it suggested it made 20, but we will freeze them and have some more another day. So for the cream sauce, um, we've got Dijon mustard, soy sauce, double cream, butter, beef stock, veg stock, olive oil, flour, and salt and pepper. meatballs with a bit of olive oil. They are going to go in the oven for 30 minutes on 200 degrees and then I'm going to add the chips in and reheat the sauce. So here it is, the meatballs are cooked, the chips are cooked and the cream sauce has been reheated and um, yeah it doesn't look too bad, it, it, it smells like IKEA meatball so let's try it and then we'll give you the verdict and tell you what we think. So we've just finished eating dinner now and I have to say we are very impressed. Um, we have tried fake away recipes before um, but they're never quite the same, um, there's always something missing but these were really good, they tasted just like the Ikea meatballs with the sauce so we are very impressed. Now the only tip I would have is to maybe half the meatball recipe because it did make over 40 quite generous sized meatballs which is too much for us so we have frozen them and we'll have them another time but if you um, were just looking for maybe three or four then probably half the recipe I think you would get um, the same amount as we did which was about 23, 25 um, with that reduced quantity so yes very impressed with Ikea thank you for sharing the recipe and um, yes We'll hope to uh, share more fake away recipes soon because there are more that are being released. Um, so we'll, we'll give them a try and then see what we think. Um, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe.